let us move on now to step number 12. Step number 12 says we need to insert a header and footer on all nodes and handouts. Include the date and time updated automatically, uh, the page number and a footer with the text uh, 1E to know. Okay, let us go to our, let us go to our, uh, our, uh, to the PowerPoint presentation. Remember, you need to first click insert. Okay, once you've, you have the option to insert, go to header and footer. Okay, once you here, remember they give us instruction like that's related to notes and handouts, not just the slide. So we don't do anything here. As much as it has what we are looking for, we're not gonna do anything here. So you click on notes and handouts. Then remember they said you need to include, okay, date and time, date and time. Then make sure that uh, update automatically is selected, right? Once you're done with that, the instruction continues to say, uh, okay, uh, okay, the page number, make sure the page number is ticked. So in my case, it's like, it's always ticked. So then it's ticked. And then the other thing you need to know, you need to add some words on your, on your footer and a footer with a text. So if they say a footer with a text, we need to type this. Okay. I'm going to copy that and then go back to my slide presentation footer under footer here footer you click on your footer so that you can be able to type then you paste you paste the information that you copied to remove the extra space then you need to click on apply to all of them why are we saying apply to all of them because the instructions told us they say a footer on all notes and handouts that this all means that you need to apply to all of them. So let's go back, click on apply to all. Okay. And then we are done with uh, instruction number 12. Okay. So let's combine instruction 12 and instruction 13. Okay. Mm, let's go back to the instruction file. <clears throat> instruction 13 say display the document properties. As the te as the text type you know okay we need to type you know as what as the tag so I'm gonna do that go back to this file click on file okay you click on file then you come to you look for text this is where it's written text then under text next to text you click you paste what what you've copied and then you save okay i have saved so that means i'm done the next step is to submit this assignment and make sure that you get 100 percent if you did everything that i did you are guaranteed to get 100 percent if you've skipped some of the steps that i've actually made videos for please uh, locate those videos in our uh, in our youtube channel and then get your 100 percent thank you